tutorial on how to create a moving average crossover EA without the required coding here in FX Streamer. So to start with, we're going to um, to say to predetermine that there's no trade warning at the moment. If there's no trade warning, then um, these conditions pass. It's important that you realize here in uh, FX Streamer that um, it's just you have to com combine one condition with another. So the condition here is that the moving average crosses above moving average 20 and that the candle closes. So in our case, this means you have to change the candle ID to one. Candle ID is something I'm going to talk about in a future video to um, so you have a deeper understanding on how it really, really works. Then um, also the same thing for the cell site. So after you have done this, you will have to connect a buy and the sell. So you, if you work with FX Dreamer, it's really important that you um, use a lot of logic and um, you know you have to it's like making a, hist a story in this in this would be the story if there's no current trade and the condition that moving average of five cost over the moving average of 20 then buy yeah in buy you can choose how with how much any lots uh, the stop loss and the take profit. Same thing goes for here. Stop loss, take profit. Um, that's pretty much it. Um, it was a pretty simple EA to do. What you have to do next is you have to download it and let it run in the EA. Right now we are in the MT4 uh, strategy tester. So you can see um, it's currently trading, um, it's a trading simulation. You can see how it really develops. And I loaded up our moving average course. And um, yes, that's pretty much to show you how you can make your first EA with uh, FX Dreamer. And especially how, um, how easy it is to actually do something very complicated in terms of newbie coding. But um, yeah, stay tuned. I will have uh, more videos soon.